Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to the Nine Miles Gadget Review channel. Today is gonna to be a fun one. I'm gonna make a, the Fisher Original Fair Scone and Shortcake Mix, but I'm not gonna make it on your normal baking sheet. I'm gonna make it in a waffle maker and it's part of their waffle recipe. So, Fisher Scone, if you don't know, is kind of a famous scone. Uh, it's a Northwest Original since 1911, it says. You get an 18 ounce mix. You can buy these pre-packaged and you know buy the mix and uh, just make yourself a fisher scone it says kindle the kid in you like that first ride on the ferris wheel fisher brings back the thrill of childhood remember pulling each other in wagons around the block playing in your treehouse saving up for a penny candy binge making an annual pilgrimage to the fair the tradition dating back to the early 1900s our famous fisher fisher Fair scones serve as a signature food attraction at state and local fair across the Northwest with fresh baked goodness in every bite. And yeah, it goes on and on, but there you go. Gives a little history on the back. And so yeah, let's make the waffle recipe, which is one package scone mix. So let's open it up. So here's the package of scone mix. Get some scissors. Dump it in the bowl. It's gonna make quite a bit, I would say, of waffles. You know, definitely enough for one person. All right, two cups cold water. These are half cups. cups cold water. Next, four large eggs. Then, <laughs> so you beat together water and eggs, add all right. So, yeah, it's, it's basically done. So, you just kind of mix it up. Whenever I cook a recipe, I'm like, why don't I do this more often? It's just so, I mean, it's just it's so much better. And it's, it's so easy, too. You just remember how, you know, I guess with anything, it's just kind of like convincing yourself to just do it is half the battle. And, uh, you know, once you do it, it's just, it's not that difficult. It's just, but the energy it takes to just kind of get everything started, you know, prepare the ingredients, get everything together. All right, so that's it. I'm looking forward to testing these out. So I'm gonna keep this up and uh, hopefully make some delicious waffles. Here we go. All right, so here we go. Start loading this thing up. You can hear that sizzle. I'm gonna try not to overload these things. There we go. I think this one's gonna be overloaded, but hopefully not. All right, so I'm gonna open it up, see what it looks like. And yeah, look at that, perfect. So let's hopefully it pulls, there we go. Yeah, success. It's always nice when it doesn't stick. I've had this waffle maker for years. I believe the brand is, or the brand is Westinghouse. 
but uh, still works great. All right, so let's get a nice, perfect one. How about that one? And I'm just gonna put some butter on it. Cut off a piece. So yeah, Fisher scone, fair scones, waffle recipe, taste test, three, two, one. Yeah, that was good. So. First thing is you, you get that scone flavor, but one thing that separates these from a normal in a waffle recipe is they're really, really light. You know, like not dense at all. It's like real fluffy. But just super, super good. Yeah. If you want to take your waffles to the next level, that was delicious. Yeah. I mean, definitely could be a dessert. I would say, you know, it would definitely be a dessert, or if you want it for breakfast, but uh, just adding, you know, some whipped cream, uh, you know, syrup. I don't, you could even add chocolate sauce. The classic thing with scones is getting some, you know, preserves, like raspberry, strawberry. That would be amazing as well butter yeah really good so yeah I think in this form factor the waffles I like it better than just a regular scone I mean I think there's something about a scone that just people you know remember and it you know kind of has a nostalgic aspect to it but I do like the waffle idea so yeah, there's the second batch, and yeah, so just once again, if you couldn't tell by my reaction, I do recommend the Fisher Fair Scone Mix, and definitely the, the waffle version of that. So thanks for watching, everyone. Until next time, I'll see you later.